Well, now that's taken care of. I can think and start my day. So much better than going in the woods and having to use pine needles, because that's basically all I got around here to use. Don't want to use any leaves or something, anything like that. Well, I guess it's time to head to the cab and see if our groceries are here, and hopefully we got some answers to the questions that we left them. Well, there's our groceries for today. Let's see uh, if they answered any of my questions that I had. The answers to your questions. One, I'm the one who owns this farm and is supplying you food. Kind of already know that. Here is the map of the farm. Well, that'd be useful. The star shows where you are. Well, yeah, I... I okay, that's not quite the, the answer I was looking for. Good call on the chickens. Ten chickens is a good start. Well, I, I just built a chicken pen. I didn't really buy the chickens yet. Are the chickens here? The eggs shall feed you for a while. Next few days I may not get here. Need to tend to my other farms. They have more than this farm? Okay. I feel this cab is not suitable for you. Feel free to build another like you did with the outhouse. Run this farm like it is your own, but do watch your spending. All right, just put the groceries away. Yeah, I don't... I mean... They know I'm not spending my nights in the cabin because must be, I mean they're coming right to the door. I mean, are they not going in thinking I don't know. Or maybe they see me sleep. I have no idea. But well, apparently they know I don't like the cabin too much. I mean the cabin is kind of run down. They got broken glass. I mean the bed and everything is not quite Yeah. I don't want to spend my nights in there. Uh but they must be happy with the outhouse. Um we got chickens, maybe? Maybe? Let me go down. Let me, um, go ahead and, uh, no, okay, yeah, I've got to take the hoses off first. Now we'll take that off. Dude, I, I didn't order chickens, I just basically built the chicken, I wasn't going to buy the chickens until I had the feed. I mean, the feed is right there, I want to harvest it first thing this morning, but. Let's go on down, I mean, did he, did he buy the chickens himself? I always keep, keep saying him. I don't know if it's... I don't know who's running this farm. Um, the answers to the questions, though, it's kind of vague answers. All right, so here's... here's. Uh, better be careful. Yes, there are chickens around here, and they're free range, so I better be careful when I'm driving around here. Well, no eggs, uh, but we do have chickens running around here. And we do have a rooster. Well, okay. Yeah, with no feed, I don't expect to get any eggs. Well, I do have groceries for the day, so that should keep me well enough fed. Just need to be careful when I drive around here, because the chickens are free-range chickens. Um, with all the insects on the ground, they should have plenty of food that way as well, but... I do have barley for them. do have some barley for them. I probably should start making like a little bit of a road down and around through here. I mean, I guess I'm going to start the day by getting a harvest done and feed the chickens. But he says I can build a, I can build another house. I mean, that's that's great and all. Uh, supplies. I really don't have the supplies. I don't even know where to where I would even build. Uh, maybe I'll have to check the map later on. Um, since this trailer is already out here, I guess I'll just leave this here. I don't, I don't know how much yield we're going to get, but, uh, all right, let's jump on out, and, yeah, last time I fired up the combine, it had a little bit of a problem, but, um, I did recharge the battery, so hopefully it starts up. It did. Perfect. Uh, can the header come up? Thank you. Yeah, I don't know when was the last time I actually ran, but starting it a couple days ago. It didn't go too well. Alright, let's go ahead and unfold the harvester. Well, I'm having a hard time getting the header to start. I'm wondering... Ah, that would explain it. The hoses are not attached. Let's get those attached. I said, let's get those attached. There we go. Now will she fire up? There she goes. And hopefully I'm chopping the straw. We are good. I don't want to leave a straw swath. I could just 
cause problems later on when it reseed the field. But we should have enough feed for the chickens for a while from here. And if I'm lucky, I may sell some. I really would like to get some kind of a spreader so I can spread some lime and fertilizer down. But really, in order to do that, probably going to need somewhere around 30 grand. By the time I buy a spreader, buy the product I need, and I need a little bit extra cash as well, probably to refill the seed drill at some point. You'll have to check the farm's finances later on. He said, run, they said, run it like it's my own farm, so I'll try to do so. This field is actually in pretty good condition. The only thing I didn't get done on it was getting a second stage of fertilization down on it. Only because I couldn't. And I did hand weed this field. Don't want to do that again. I probably should go check my canola field. That's probably got weeds in it, but... Yeah, I really don't feel like hand weeding it today. But what I might do is start searching and maybe start making a third field. Really start expanding this farm a little bit so I can get some more income. Yeah, it's just strange that I still don't know who I am or where I'm from or how I even got here or where even here is. But farming... Not a problem. I can remember all that. And I haven't lost any of my memory that... You know, since I've been here, my memory is staying intact. From that, I just don't remember who I am. Oh, well. Okay. I may just be here for a while until I can figure it all out. Although I should take it somewhat easy to take. My head is hurting a little bit. Not as bad as it was a few days ago. Seems like it's getting better. Yeah, so I don't know how much feed the chickens are going to take and how much grain we're to get off this field. I mean, if I could sell some and get some money in, that'd be great, but... I suppose I could just feed the chickens and sell it all and replant some more wheat or barley. It won't take me too long to get some more in. So that's what I'll probably have to do. So I did spend about six grand on nails, paint, and materials to buy the, you know, put the chicken coop down. Yeah, I am thinking, though, uh, maybe I'll wait until I feed the chickens, see how much they take. And if I seem like I got enough for a while, then maybe I may go ahead and plant, like, soybeans down here. I need to be better about planting this field. I've missed a couple spots. At least the combine seems to be running in pretty good, uh, pretty good fashion. So by the letter I got this morning, it sounds like they won't be here for a couple of days. So I should make sure that these groceries I got last me a little while until the chickens are actually producing eggs. I do have some food left over from the uh, past few days from the groceries. They believe me quite a bit, and I'm not much of an eater. Yes, yeah, so we're not getting a huge yield off this field. I think a combine like this must hold like 6,500 liters.
but now I just got to make sure I maintain those chickens down there because they're going to be my my source of food for a while. Not the chickens themselves, just the eggs. I can eat eggs for a while until I figure out another form of some kind of food being provided. And I didn't ask, but I should, should have asked about the water over there if it's safe enough. But like I said, since we provided ourselves power the other day, I can always grab some of the water and boil it, which I probably should do anyways. Just to be on the safe side. Combines are getting might be a little full, so let's pop in what we have into a trailer here. Maybe this is why they wanted me to plant barley when I was the first couple days I was here. They knew I'd be getting some chickens. Might even have it even enough to fill the trailer. Doesn't even look like it. Well, there's my first harvest taken care of. Must be the trailer is full. Now let's turn the combine off there and I'll come back and unload it here in just a second. Uh be nice if I hooked up the trailer first, wouldn't it? And uh, hydraulic hoses. Let's go ahead and go feed the chickens. And then I'll assess what I need to do with this field here. Man, a spreader would be great. I know the field needs lime. That would definitely help out the yield. And of course... Oh man, if I could always fertilize it afterwards as well, that would really help us out, but yeah, the farm doesn't have enough cash. Alright, chickens. There you go. Hopefully that's enough food for you for a while. And please provide me some eggs. Not only that I can uh, have some meals. But also sell some of your eggs as well. Now, as far as I've been told, when I bring stuff to the store. I'll get paid for it instantly. And somebody will come at the end of the day and pick it up and ship it on out of here. I, I don't know. They always say, yeah, people have stuff out in the store. They'll take stuff at the store, but no one's ever there. I don't, I don't get it. Uh, the question is, do I want to sell this or do I want to put it in storage? I think for now, I'll just put it in storage. I'm not ready to fertilize a field or, or lima field. I don't think I have enough cash. Maybe once I get the canola... I will. Let's dump that into our empty silo that we had. And according to our tablet, I have $15,000 right now, or the farm does. And the spreader I was looking at online, and the catalog is like 20. Like I said, I probably need... Yeah, the combine is empty. Yeah, so... Yeah, looking at the, uh, the catalog, like I was saying, yeah, the spreader's going to be like 20, and I need like another 10 grand to buy like lime, fertilizer, and seed and such, so yeah, it's not going to quite happen for a while. Now, let me go ahead and fold up the combine, don't want to get that 
wet or anything like that, but in the, underneath the shed it shouldn't. And put that down. And turn the combine off. All right. So hopefully the chickens are being fed, or, or not being fed, but making eggs. Um, I think if I hang on to that grain for now, I think I'll go ahead and plant soybeans in here. It's probably the best thing. I got enough feed for the chickens for a while. Uh, so let's see if everything grows in two days, it seems like here. Um, in four days, I could have another harvest of wheat or barley, which would be more than enough for the chickens. Yeah, let's go ahead and plant some soybeans here. But before I do, let me go check back here. Let's go, let me go check on this canola field that we have. Just run through the woods here. See how it's going. Well, the crop is all looking pretty good. And yes, there's weeds here, but nothing I could really do about it other than grabbing the hand weeder. But man, I really don't feel like weeding that field. So I think I'm just got to leave the weeds there for now. I got plenty of other stuff to do here on the farm. But uh, yeah, let's go hitch up to Cedral and I may have to, hmm. Yeah, I may have to go fill up the Cedral. I don't know if I got enough to do so. Yeah, let me unhitch the trailer and we'll hitch up the Cedral. Yeah, the Cedral is kind of in the way for the trailer. So I'll have to do some, some moving some stuff around. Yeah, once I get the Cedral out, then later I come back the trailer back in. Hmm. Yeah, I think after I get done seeding, I need to start thinking of a, 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 a plan, a floor plan, if you will, of the farm. If I'm going to build a new house, which I probably should, because I've been noticing there's holes in the roof up here. Um, so it might be leaking on the inside when it rains. I haven't been here when it rained yet, so I don't know. And, of course, all the furniture on the inside. So I may be able to save some of this wood and get some of those nails, but, yeah, I don't know. Uh, yeah, let me hop into the tractor and let's hitch up to Cedral and start replanting some crop back in this field. Some soybeans would be good. Oh, wow. Oh, well, my head. Oh, that hurts. Man, that hurt. Ugh. And what the heck was I seeing? Some signs? Mercury Farm? Is that what that said? What the heck does that even mean? Ugh. I have no idea what those signs even meant. I, I, yeah, I, I don't know. Um... Did I unhitch this trailer? Yeah, it looks like I did. All right. Uh, maybe I should just take a break. No, I really want to get these crops put back in. I don't seem dizzy now. My head doesn't hurt as much as it did a little while ago. Hmm. Just better be careful. I think when my head really hurts, I probably need, need to be careful. The last thing I need to do is pass out while I'm driving something. That wouldn't be good at all. At least I wouldn't run over anyone because there's no one here. Alright, hitch up the Cedral. Hoses are attached. Alright, so before we start seeding... Ooh, I'm getting kind of low on seed. Very low on seed. Um, how are we doing on fertilizer? Well, looks like we're doing fine on fertilizer. Uh, let me break up the tablet here and let's go order. Let's go order some seed. 
Uh, seed bag. That's a thousand liters for 900 bucks. Well, yeah. Let's just go ahead and call that in. And head on down to the store. I guess I'll have to fill it somehow down there. Hmm. Have to figure that out here shortly. I hope the air seed is out here. Um, okay, not only is our seed out here, there's a tractor out here. Well, I guess that's the way we're going to load it. Must be they just brought it around and... Um, can I use that to help load up my seed drill? Hello? Wow, that looks familiar. Where have I seen that before? Hmm. There's food in there, but that looks like it's been in there for a while. I guess I could always come here and get some water. If there's anything in there. Don't know. Well, with no one around, I think... Um, Alright. I mean, maybe they left it here for me to use? Alright, let's fill up our seed roll. So we can get going and seed up our field. Um, let's see here. I don't want to tie up their tractor or run over their flower pot. Uh, let me put this out of the way. I mean, I guess I could go bring it to the farm, but that does me no good. I don't have no way to lift it up and get into the seed drill, so I have to put it here. And I'll put their tractor I suppose right over here? Well, I mean, if they don't mind me using it. Either way, I think I have enough fertilizer. All right, back to the farm. We'll get that seed planted in. And then I'll start roaming around and maybe start planning out where to build, a, like, a log cabin. I mean, since we own the land, I guess the trees are ours, so I can cut down trees, kind of like I did with the outhouse. And build, like, a log cabin, I suppose. All right, let's get some soybean planted. Good thing that this is the direct grill, save me some time having to cultivate. And since I didn't plant something like corn or something like that, I really don't need to plow and dig up all the root balls that are down there. Yeah, I might uh, go back down to the store afterwards and top off the seed drill just in case. Uh, hopefully that tractor is still there so I can use it. I wonder if I should buy some fertilizer as well and top off the seed drill then because if it's still there, I may need it. Man, the things I need on this farm to... I mean, yeah, a front loader would be great to have on this farm. I'm going to need it eventually to lift up those egg pallets. But hopefully in a couple days' time... We'll have harvested the canola. I can sell the canola. I don't need that for anything. And the soybean here, I can sell that. I'll keep the barley for now for the chickens. The windmill is producing some money for us, little by little. 
Hmm. But I think definitely the first step is I need to get a spreader so that I can spread some lime down, some fertilizer. That's going to increase our yield quite a bit. And in my spare time, start planning on where I can build myself a log cabin. And also putting in another field. Now the thing is, I got to do all the work myself, so I got to be careful how much, how many fields I put down, how big of a field I put down. I don't have, there's only so much of me to go around. But yet there's so much land here, so how am I going to make this work? So many thoughts going through my head. That's probably not a good thing. I don't know what else has caused me to pass out once in a while. Yeah, I think one more field, a decent sized one. Bigger than I made on the last one for sure would be fine. Uh, if I start making bigger fields, I'm going to need bigger equipment. But, yep, short on cash for that for a while. I think three fields is manageable for the equipment that I have to use and the time that I have. Probably a field straight ahead on the other side of these rocks might not be too, too bad. That class tractor I used at the store for a little while was kind of a nice one. Of course, it was nice and clean as well. I'd like to clean these things, but I don't have no way to clean them yet. So many things to buy, yet yeah, I don't have the cash for it. Slowly but surely, we'll get the cash and I'll be able to buy some more things for the farm, hopefully. I mean, I guess we're doing fine so far. I mean, I came here and there was no money at the farm. We got chickens. And we got $10,000 at least in the bank account. Now we got two fields replanted. It's all coming together. Except for my memory. That's going to be lost forever, probably. I don't know. Alright, um, how do I want to do this here? I don't need the seed drill for a while, meaning a day or so, but I will need a trailer. Maybe I should leave this hitch up and go back down to the store and top that off. Yeah, let me leave this like that for a few minutes. Just taking a walk down the road. Figure I'd come on, check on, on the chickens. See how they're going. It's only been a couple hours. But I need to just walk around a bit. Uh, kind of looking around to see where I might build the new cabin. Uh, but getting in some daily exercise as well. Running in tractors all day long doesn't quite do it. Well, no eggs as of yet, but I'm pretty sure it will take some time. I'm pretty sure the chickens are a little stressed out. Kind of like uh, I am a little bit sometimes. They just moved here. They probably don't know where they are. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, they're not going to lay any eggs until they know otherwise. I am thinking, though, if I'm going to rebuild a cabin... I think my preference would be a nice view of the pond. And if I need trees to make the cabin, I'm going to be cutting trees down up over here probably because that's the closest to the table saw. Let me just jog over here. I mean... How is it in here? If I start cutting down these trees here. Have the front of the cabin facing this way. I get a nice view of the pond. I can kind of use my binoculars to check on the chickens. 
and the farm is in view. That wouldn't be too bad. Yeah, so maybe I'll have to get my chains, the chainsaw out and cut down some trees here. And uh, start making... Start making a way to uh, put down a log cabin. I can probably find enough stone around here as well. There's enough stone laying around to make the foundation. I need more stone like I found for the outhouse. And I found plenty of it that's in the woods. And then I can tear down this little this little camp. Which wouldn't be a too bad of a place later on to put another shed. So everything is not really piled up in here. Hmm, I think I got a plan kind of put together. I think so. And we got to feel the soybeans. So a couple more days. Get a good harvest of soybeans in. Next day should be a good day for harvest of canola. Sell the canola and hopefully I get enough cash and I can get a fertilizer spreader and maybe get fertilizer down at least on this field. Get a full stage of fertilizer down. Yeah, then I can put some lime down as well and we get a good yield off these two fields. In the meantime... Maybe what I'll do is I'll get started on plowing a field down here. Maybe that's what I'll do in this afternoon is uh, to start plowing away over here. Yeah, I think a field down here would be really, really good. It's close enough to the farm. Yeah. All right. So I think I got a plan for my next few days here on the farm. I think I'm all set. Maybe I should go write all these plans down because I never know if I lose my memory again. You know, it'd be nice to to know what my plans were. I should actually write myself a letter inside of the cabin. That way, if I ever find it, if I lose my memory again, I'll have an idea of what's going on and what I know so far. Yeah, I want to go ahead inside the cabin and do that. And then I'll get to plowing the field later on. Let me go write that letter.